cerebral stimulation or brain pacemaker surgery uh, is an ingenuous uh, surgical procedure which is used in uh, patients who are suffering from chronic neurological problems who are disabled in despite medications it is less like a cardiac pacemaker where instead of the wires being put in the heart they are put in a particular area of the brain and then connected to a pulse generator what we call as a pacemaker so that by continuous electrical stimulation of the involved part of that brain patient's quality of life is improved by reduction in the neurological symptoms there are some established or approved indications for deep brain stimulation the commonest indication for deep brain stimulation is movement disorder which includes parkinson's disease tremors essential tremor dystonia deep brain stimulation is also used for advanced and intractable epilepsy patients in adults and it is also used in certain psych psychiatric indications like obsessive compulsive disorder deep brain stimulation is only used in the above indications when the disease gets advanced and doesn't respond properly to medications or the medications cause unacceptable side effects deep brain stimulation is performed uh, by a team of doctors which includes a neurosurgeon a functional neurosurgeon a movement disorder neurologist and a neurophysician a neuropsychiatrist where first we analyze and ascertain the candidature of the patient where in our movement disorder clinic to make sure that the patient is a good candidate for surgery once that first step is taken then the patient is admitted and a deep brain stimulation specific computerized advanced mri is done following which the patient is taken to the or before the surgery starts we have to put a frame or fix a frame to the patient's head which is just like the gps of the car because the target of our interest in the brain is so small it's between a few millimeters we have to be absolutely precise to reach there this frame what we call as a stereotactic head frame helps us in achieving that objective by working like a gps of the car planning computerized planning is done with the help of the stereotactic head frame the dbs is done in two stages in stage 1 two wires are put inside the brain one on each side patient is awake during the surgery in most cases so that during the surgery itself we can ascertain the benefit of the therapy so it's an awake neurosurgery stage 2 is where the wires are then hooked up with the pacemaker it's a shorter procedure which is done under general anesthesia deep brain stimulation is a long term uh, solution for patients who are suffering from advanced neurological diseases it is a reversible and adaptable technology and with the help of sessions known as brain pacemaker programming sessions we can tune the pacemaker from time to time so as to account and adjust for the progression of the disease